Hello again, guys. This is Soap the Great with another episode of Building This City. I am... Well, today I'm going to just look around, show you what I've been up to, and then show you some of the stuff that I've found around the base area here. Um, well, let's see. I'm getting some frame rate issues. I think it's because Fraps is recording right now. Um, anyway, this has not changed much. I did put in some furnaces because I've been getting some clay and sand, and I've needed glass. Um, you see this structure here, the gravel. This is the foundation for the house that I'm going to build. Um, and that is probably, well, that's coming up soon um, where I actually do that build, but I've got to collect a lot of resources for that, a lot of wood. And then I've built this tunnel because I really want most of my stuff to be over in that mountain right there. You can see a little bit of what I've done right there, a little tunnel. So let's go. Let's go down in there. Um, actually, real quick, it is about night time. Am I gonna catch it? Okay, so this episode may seem a bit choppy. I'm gonna be recording it over a few days, just showing you progress of of uh, some of the stuff I'm doing around here. Um, let's see. One of the things, I'm not going to show you, but there was a jungle temple there. And you can see the pillar that the guys marked it off with. Um, I am tearing that down. I'm going to replant jungle trees in its place. And then um, I will show you another thing that I'm going to be working on. First, let's go down here. You know what? There's one one more thing I needed. This is actually a dual purpose trip here. I'm going to show you what I've been doing and then show you something that... Um, uh, one of the reasons why... Ooh, almost fell. Wow. That would have been bad. I need that. And... Not escaping. Okay, and I've got the flint and steel. So obsidian and flint of steel, or flint and steel. What do you think I'm going to be doing? We'll see in just a moment. You've probably already guessed. Okay, so this is not really a mine shaft per se. This is for the purpose of just getting across particles. So I've made this tunnel three high, three wide, and um, you hear some spiders down there. Heard some zombies earlier, so it's a cave system. I've not gone caving. If you look at this, I've cut out a little bit. Um, just to let you know, we are currently on um, 1.6.4. Let's turn on the sound a little bit. And that is the structure update. It's a fix for the upcoming uh, 1.7 release. And so we're now on this, and so we're just taking our time going around the world and loading up structures because um, if we just go into 1.7, then uh, we are going to lose structures and um, you know in the overworld we haven't done too much but uh, there's one thing I'm going to show you soon so um, we'll, uh, we'll we'll get that uh, or I'll show you that and I'll, I'll tell you why it's important that we fill this in but let's let's take our coordinates real quick and you're probably telling me right now okay you see that I'm gonna take a screenshot there we go, and then we'll pull that off. I've got the numbers already. 
um, we are at uh, 766 on the X and uh, 2464 on the Z. Uh, the X I can't help. Um, I, I need to be in multiples of 8 because I'm doing a nether portal. The 2464 is exact. This is a chunk boundary right here. So it is exactly a multiple of 8. 766 is not, so the uh, the nether portal is going to be slightly off. If you're not familiar with that, the nether portals connect um, in multiples of 8. That's just how the nether works. It, it is a uh, multiple of 8 um, travel anyway. So you go 1 meter in the nether, you, it's the same as going 8 meters in the overworld and that translates the same to nether portals. So um, I've already got the numbers figured and, and we're going to go to the nether to uh, set that up real soon, but not through this portal. Um, you'll notice I made it 3 by 3 and that's because of 1.7 you can have uh, variable width and height uh, portals. Um, so when that time comes I will knock out that set of obsidian and relight this thing and I'm going to do the same thing up in the nether so anyway for now um, there's one more thing I needed to take care of I saw some clay so real quick and this is a lot of what I've been doing just excavating this and finding clay and, um, a lot of grindy work. My shovel's probably going to break on me here soon. Where was that? I had no more inventory space when I saw this batch. So I wasn't able to get it. And I don't even see it now. And we've got stuff to do. So you know what? I'll come back and get that later. Um, one of the things that I wanted to show you is a mine that I'm going to be working on. And, and you know, you could do a mine anywhere, but this one's going to be more like a quarry. Oh, <gasps> fish. Yes. Cat, 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 cat. Am I going to get one? Where did he go? They've apparently gotten more skittish in 1.6. I have not. Ooh, hey. Well, that's interesting. Hmm. What do you think, guys? Am I going to get a cat? Oh, this would be cool. Where did he go? Oh, down in here. Yeah, they're a lot more skittish. This may be a, a more of a long-term project. Oh, there he is. He's not even in jungle biome. Mm. <laughs> Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. if I've gotten one in 1.6 or if it was just 1.5 Oh well that will have
have to wait. Okay. Um, and no, forest, I'm not threatening to burn you down. either but okay and let me make sure nasty stuff doesn't spawn there and we've got caves okay nothing too big and now I'm a little bit lost Let's see. Oh, it's this way. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Marker. Okay. So I've got chunk the boundaries of an entire chunk outlined here with the cobble. And there's more cats. This is good to know. I'll get one eventually, and I'll let you know when I do. Um, I'm going to excavate an entire chunk all the way down to bedrock. How does that sound? What do you think? Um, so anyway, this is the start. Um, I killed a pair of shears already. I will continue doing that. And then uh, just get all the resources out of there. Cobble and, and uh, coal, diamond. I'm going to find every bit of it. Um, that is some of what I've been doing. Okay, so um, let me get to the nether and then um, I will put together the nether, nether portal. Or actually, we're going to be digging over to where I'm going to have the nether portal. Um, oh, and before that, I'll show you what uh, something that one of the other guys on the server found. So, I will be right back. Alright, here we are, folks. You see this? Witch hut. Yep. This is why we need to do the uh, structure update. Um, this witch hut is within 300 blocks of my home. What direction are we facing? I need to go south. I want to get to the existing nether portal. So we've got that witch hut within 300 of my home. And, uh, yeah, um, I've got a project ahead of me as a result. I am going to be turning that into a witch farm. And witches drop uh, redstone, glowstone, gunpowder, flasks, uh, sugar. They occasionally drop potions. Occasionally. Um... So, yeah, we, uh, and I just want some ice. Okay. Now, I need to find the existing nether portal. There were pigs close by, weren't there? Yep, there we go. 
and we're going to go through. And uh, I will see you when... Well, no. Let's go through. Okay, okay. So, we were just here the other day. And we need to go to... Let me uh, get my F coordinates here real quick. So, based on those um, those uh, coordinates earlier, we need to go to 95 on the X and negative 308 on the Z. The Y does not matter as far as these calculations go. Um, it, it's probably better to lock the Y in place, but it doesn't do the divide by 8 deal that... Um, why am I not sprinting? Huh, okay, that's strange. Um, it doesn't do the divide by 8 thing that the X and Z coordinates do. Um, so the Y in the overworld corresponds directly to the Y in the nether. So what, but what I need to do is I need to go to 95 and negative 308. Now, I am going to be doing that not from that. This is Aston's corridor. I'm going to dig out a new corridor and I'll probably expand this room a little bit um, and put down half slabs in places because then I don't have any. I want to make sure ghasts do not spawn in here. I don't know if they will. They might. Um, I'll just be ready if they do. For now, wow. Yeah. Put that away. Okay, efficiency. Efficiency four, unbreaking three is pretty quick. Um, so let me take care of that, and then I will be right back. All right, folks. Let's see. Okay, so I've dug that tunnel. Yeah, there we go. Making sure the microphone's in the right spot. So I've dug that tunnel. We'll take a look at the coordinates here. 95, negative 308. So, uh, not what I wanted. Let's see. Let's turn off. There we go. That gets annoying after a while. I'll tell you that. And like I did with the overworld one, I want this to be three. Look at that. That efficiency. Amazing. Gotta watch out. Ran into a couple lava pits down here. Alright, and, and if you notice, the most I can do is just light a fire right there, seeing as we are not running the snapshot. So for now, I have to be content with this. Ready for the moment of truth? Ready? Let's go. Please, please, please. Yes. And return. Good stuff. Right there. All right. So we got the nether portal set up. Um, let's see. Let me do a check on how long this episode is going to see um, how much more we're going to do. So I will be right back. All right, folks. Um, the episode is sitting at 20 minutes, which is about what I want to stick with for now. Um, so I am going to wrap this up. That is it for this time. Um, next time, I'll just I'll just keep showing you more progress, um, and then we'll probably be starting on the house at that point. Um, I'll do a lot of that grindy stuff off camera, uh, like collecting wood and uh, smelting sand and ore and mining and all that. I'm gonna do that off camera, um, but the building I'll, I'll probably include most of that on camera. We won't build the whole thing. Uh, just because it is a pretty big build and I have a hard time concentrating and building. So uh, for now, 
Um, that is it. And I will see you next time.